What's up and welcome to the channel again. Today, I'm going to be working on this X Pro Pit Bike. It's a free bike. I'm going to try to see if I get it running. It missing pretty much anything, everything. It will use as a part bike. I still have the key. Missing most of the hardware bolts and stuff. The harness is jacked up. Still have compression. So that's good. It's a 125cc. And here's the major problem. The end of the crank. You pretty much screw it up. Let me see if I can turn it over. And here's the keyway. So I'm gonna have to try to fix the keyway. Well, I had to replace the whole crank, but I'm gonna try to fix the keyway and uh, be thread in at the uh, crankshaft first. So, until I do anything else, until I get it done, I don't do anything else. So, I'm gonna start on it. I have this to try to rethread it. The keyway won't be too bad, but be threading the end of the neck that with the trouble come in with. So it's a nice bike. Had to replace stator, the wire harness. Need a new car. Uh, throw the cable. The clips still works. Also, and also the brakes. It's good. The salt's falling off. Stay there to the side. So, get you on when I start rethreading the end of the nick. Okay, so what I decided to do is just remove the entire engine. You have a upper knot bolt here, which is already gone. I really, like I said, slid one end through this side just for the support. Over the right side, and you have two two ten millimeters at the bottom here and here and here and here. If you want to remove the skid plate, also and two eights up here at the top. But yeah, I think I'm gonna remove the skid plate first. So I got it. Something holding this gear. So. Okay, here's a closer look at the current with its script thread and the jacked up keyway. I removed the engine completely off the bike. Now I got my sandpaper 80 grit. Be better with a cutting dish and I'm cutting sanding down this mushroom on. I got a second die stick. I'm gonna rethread the crank itself and Okay, just a quick update on the bike. Got some parts in. I fixed the thread on the crank. Uh, the, I'm being the flywheel a little. Install the stator. They have the screws for it, so I use a uh, license plate screw. Pretty much all the screws on the engine is M6 by 1.0. I know a lot of them are in the back case. So, so I installed it. Have a new carb on it, new wire harness, with the ignition switch. Uh, just hit the throttle uh, cable and the clutch cable. New ignition coil, new CDI box. Uh, Remove the plastic for the installer. I'm gonna tidy up the wire a little uh, later. I uh, installed the hand grips with the kill switch. Now I'm gonna fabricate a top engine mount bolt. I have a uh, long thread to ride. I'm gonna end up cutting. I know the case have a crack in it, but it shouldn't leak past the O-ring in the stator. Uh, 
but I'm gonna cut the thread to ride and I have a couple nuts on locking nuts that I'm gonna use for the top engine mount bolts. And then I just had to replace the skid plate and the exhaust and the plastic. And it should be ready to go. Anything else I'm forgetting? I'll set it. Okay. Also got a new spark plug in it also. Yeah, and I had to uh, I had to fix the keyway in the flywheel also. It turns over. So yeah, you're on the right track, you gotta keep going. And I'm gonna update you when I get a little more done. Okay, I'm back with another update. Got the keyway JB Wheel is in there. I did one I filled in the hole with the JB Wheel. Dropped the keyway in there and spread the JB Wheel around the side of it. And it actually in there pretty tight. I was thinking about doing the big board here on when I get it running. So I pretty much gonna change the flywheel then. It looks used to doing it twice, doing the same job twice. But yeah, hey, put the flywheel on and it fit pretty snug. So, and I got the exhaust just to feed it also. Had to find bolts for that one also. Pretty much had to replace every bolt on here. Dealing with the engine. And yeah, it's almost ready to start now. I just gotta put the flywheel back on and put the plastic on with this. See if it's gonna start. Okay, we're back with the complete bike. Got everything put back together. Got the gas line connected. Gas tank installed. The plastic. Got the exhaust. Got to replace some more missing bolts also. Okay, Add some oil water and some gas. And. We'll get back, we'll see if it starts. Okay, we got it filled with oil and gas. About to attempt the first start. And see what it's going to do. No. Yeah, from the car. 